For the past four years here at Today, we've been searching the country to find the very best outdoor holiday decorations in America. And although we found some amazing homes, I don't think we've ever seen anything quite like the Williams House in Mason, Ohio. <laughs> Mind behind that assault on the census is engineer Carson Williams. He and his wife Sherry and their daughters Brittany and Amanda join us outside their suburban Cincinnati home. Hello, Williams family. How are you? Good. Good. How are you doing today? I'm fine. Most importantly, what's your electric bill this month, Carson? <laughs> uh, it, it adds about $150 in, during the month of December because the lights are only on from 6 to 10 and uh, they blink a lot, so you don't get a lot of uh, usage. When did you start doing this? When did you go from putting up just a normal display, holiday display, to something so elaborate? Actually, if you ask my wife, uh, first, I've actually never done a normal display. So <laughs> she wanted some lights. <laughs> she wanted some lights on the house, and I work in computers. So I said, "There's got to be a way to control it with computers." So I found a website, PlanetChristmas.com, and that was about eight years ago. And then about three years ago, I found a website. Uh, Christmas Wonders, where he had synced the a fifth of Beethoven to music, and I'm like, that's the way to go. <laughs> so about three years ago is when I started doing the synchronization to the music, and it's been growing ever since. Meanwhile, Carson, I, I understand your wife Sherry, and Sherry, you can jump in on this, will not let okay. you start putting the lights up until after October 1st. Now, there are 25,000 yep. lights in this display, so how long does it actually take you to complete it once you begin? Oh, it's, it, it takes all the way till I turn the lights on, which is the day after Thanksgiving. So I'm allowed to do the house lights in October, but I'm not allowed to put anything on the yard till after Halloween. Hey, Carson, so that's another rule I have. Hey, Carson, what do your neighbors think about this? Because obviously there's a certain amount of light, there's some sound, and there's traffic because you, you have all these people coming by to see this thing. Oh, they, they seem to be really into it so far th this year. Uh, the, the sound, we actually broadcast on a low FM transmitter, so there's actually no sound in the neighborhood, just the lights blinking in your houses. Uh, we run it from 6 to 10, so we don't get too much, you know, let, let everyone go to bed sometime. And then this year is the, f <laughs> this year is the first uh, really traffic lead, so it, so far everyone's been really courteous. I told the neighbors and I told the sheriff, if, if they get any complaints, I'll shut it down because, I mean, the neighbors are more important to me than the Christmas lights. I do the Christmas lights for myself. And Sherry, what do you think of this? I have to tell you, I think it's cool, but, I mean, after about 30 seconds, it's giving me a headache this big. How do you feel about it? I love it. It's great. I think it's, I mean, it's just amazing. Actually, Sherry's helped me put together, uh, she did one secret song, which is uh, Snoopy and the Red Baron. Uh, the Snoopy's Christmas. She actually did the music herself and uh, synchronized it also. Yeah, you allowed me to touch it one time. Yeah, and, uh, <laughs> I just want to mention something. For people passing by, Carson, you actually do an FM radio broadcast so they can tune their car radios as they're on your street and actually pick up the music you're broadcasting so they get a better sound, right? Th that is correct. That's correct. Uh, you know, that, with, that way I'm not you know, bothering the neighbors with speakers and stuff. Uh, actually, sometimes people turn the cars up too loud and then you hear it anyway, but it works out pretty well. Brittany and Amanda, are you the most popular girls in school because of your dad's crazy, I mean your dad's uh, display? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Go on. My best friend calls me Miss Popular. <laughs> Well, it, it's really, it's amazing. And as you mentioned, the only thing it adds about 150 bucks to your electric bill. We should also mention you work for a company that is a subsidiary of NBC's parent company, General Electric. And that's why you're not eligible that's for right. the I'll Be Home for Christmas contest, right? That's right. That is correct. That but is he correct. is work bringing good things Bell. to life. There you go. <laughs> Imagination at work. <laughs> hey, listen, Williams family, happy holidays to all of you, all right? You right. too. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Okay. Now turn off that music. <laughs> yeah. Those are lucky. If anybody's got though. anything that they think can can compete Top with that. that, go to today.msnbc.com and register.